Hello students, welcome to this very short tutorial showing you how to add margins to your workspace. So first of all, to add margins, we're going to need to um, add rulers. Uh, so rulers are a tool that we can view in our workspace that can help us to uh, plan where we place our objects. So we go to view because it's something that we can view. We go to rulers and show rulers. Now, if you notice, um, this ruler has appeared along the horizontal and vertical space. So once the ruler is showing, um, you need to hover your cursor over the ruler, click and drag down. And then wherever you drop your cursor, you will have a guideline. OK, you can do that from the side as well. So click, drag, and then you can drop. Using the ruler as a guide, you can choose how many pixels you would like your margin to be in from the edge of your document. And again, um, there is what we call margin canon, which has been introduced in a lecture, which explains how we can create a visually congruent um, alignment of uh, positive and ne negative space. The margin canon has been developed primarily for books and manuscripts, so it's not um, as rigid for artwork, but you might borrow some of the principles to create um, an interesting arrangement of positive and negative space using your margins. So this is how we create margins on our workspace. There's one last little thing we can do. We can actually just name the layer margins. And then we can create a new layer to work in and lock our margins. And that means we don't accidentally drag those grid lines because they are still active. Um, so that's how you create margins for your workspace.